Antonio Conte has been touted as the top candidate to take over at Manchester United. Earl Gunnar Solskjaer may be safe in his job at Manchester United for now, but that may be down to major doubts the club have on bringing in Antonio Conte. Reports moved quickly on Monday, detailing the toxic mood around the club following their dismal 5-0 defeat to Liverpool. Players were given the day off of training, but club officials were said to have held talks regarding Solskjaer's future. The Norwegian head coach was rewarded with a new three-year deal during the summer following a strong campaign last year. But results have taken a downward turn since the end of September, culminating in the humiliating defeat to bitter rivals Liverpool. Solskjaer cut a lonely figure as he trudged off the pitch, admitting after the game it was his darkest day in football. And it appeared as though it was going to be his last game in charge at Old Trafford as reports indicated on Monday that the club were moving ahead in talks with Conte. Italian media even indicated that Conte had said yes in initial conversations with the Red Devils, but it now appears as though Solskjaer will be given some more time to turn things around. H is set to be in the dugout this weekend as United look for their first league win since September against Tottenham. Conte remains available since leaving Inter Milan in the summer, but there is seemingly some concern from United's hierarchy on how the Italian manager would fit in. According to Jan Arge Fjortoft, United have two main reasons for not pushing ahead to bring in Conte, seems to be a major doubt at Manchester United if Conte is the best manager for the job or the best manager available for the job, he tweeted, Zinedine Zidane has also been linked with taking over at Old Trafford, but HES supposedly waiting on a better opportunity. Ari Neville has already warned his former side of replacing Solskjaer with Conte, they won't bring a hitman in. They will stick with Ole and he has to win something this season, he said.